Hello all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and uh, it is day 21 here on planet 26, and I think as I mentioned in the last episode, I want to, we need to get this power uh, grid up, uh, at least get uh, the next set of wind turb turbines up. So that's what I'm going to be working on today. So I'm going to be erecting something very similar, well, almost identical to what we have over there, and uh, placing these, uh, getting these wind turbines up and going. The other thing I want to do is try to finish up some of the stuff around the uh, drone factory, uh, get this door in on this side, that means steps coming up through into there and then uh, maybe adding a few odds and ends. The other thing I want to do is set up a task list, uh, which I did in the last season and it was actually kind of helpful to kind of keep things in order on what uh, what needed to be done. So I think what I'm going to do is I'll uh, build out the blocks out through here and just start erecting something because I'm going to have a building in here. So we're going to get the basic forms of a building and uh, I'm going to get a task list set up. So that's what's on tap for today. Uh, the last episode, if you remember, we, we actually made a flight out to our nickel mine and we were able to bring back a load of nickel so we know that that uh, uh, had enough power to get out there and back. So one of the things I'm going to need to do is uh, program the drone to fly out there on its own to pick up the nickel so I don't have to do that. Uh, and uh, I may not have it uh, continuously going back and forth, but what I might do is from time to time uh, set it off to go get a load of nickel and do that. So that's where we're at today. Uh, I'll, uh, I'm going to get started building on the uh, platforms here, uh, or the platforms, the wind turbines, and uh, I'll catch back up with you when uh, I uh, am a little farther along. Alright, well you can see I've gotten the, the first tower up with the three wind turbines on it. Uh, the scaffolding is all up there. I've got, I've got to weld this up. The power lines that are going to be coming up from out of there and down. So that's kind of my next step on uh, finishing this one up. Uh, so if we uh, kind of come over here and weld this up, and then we weld that up. And that looks good. Can we get the next one? There we go. Yep, that's looking good. So I gotta weld those up, uh, build the scaffolding out, and start building this up on this side over here. And then that will give us uh, the ability, I think, to get our batteries up to speed because I was noticing on the batteries that they were kind of falling behind a little bit. If we go over here and look at uh, fully recharge in 14 minutes. So it's on recharging side but we are starting to dip down to where they're not fully charged all the time. And I think adding these wind turbines and then uh, trying to build out uh, the rest of these batteries, uh, I still have, uh, well not all of them, but I got five on this side and one here. I got six more batteries to build out. So I think that's what uh, kind of the priority is since I was starting to see a drain on the batteries. That's why I wanted to get these wind turbines in and get this power supply working. Since we now have some nickel and we can uh, build the components 
uh, I think without too much problem and if we do need nickel we are able to go and get it so all right well that's just a bit of an update once I uh, get these a little farther along I'll uh, catch back up with you all right well I'm slowly getting this done I got the other uh, wind turbine tower in I'm going up to finish uh, welding the conduits across and you can kind of see the scaffolding that I have to put in to, to accomplish this it's a makes a bit of a, a challenge it's not too bad though uh, I'm able to plop the scaffolding down I kind of know already know I've done it enough now that I know how I want to build the scaffolding out so it works works pretty well and all right that has our piping connected in to that wind turbine base coming across and then let's see can I reach no that one's done already I'm gonna have to build more scaffolding down so what I'll probably do is maybe something like this. Uh, let's come down. Uh, if I do it like this. This is a scary part. Stepping out of the edge. That doesn't look right. All right, let's do it like this. Let's put that block in there. And then we can put that block right there. And we should be able to build our blocks just all the way across. To be able to get to our... There we go. All right, let's... Let's see if we can reach, well, we can reach this one. And I probably should have put an angle block here. Let's take this one out and angle this down. And we can weld you up. And let's see, we can get that one. And there might only be one. That ah, that might have been it. Let's go down and take a look. Yeah, we did. We got them all. All right. So those are all connected in our power. Uh is uh, flowing through and I mean everything was always connected down through here but that gives us three more wind turbines uh, functioning so I need to take that scaffolding all out and so I'll go ahead and do that and then once I get that done uh, I'll catch back up with you well I got those uh, wind turbines all in and the uh, power lines running over uh, so that those are all connected and uh, I got the scaffolding all down so it looks pretty good so the next uh, step is to start uh, uh, finish putting in these catwalks and to get a couple of more of these batteries built but as you can see, I think, if we take a look at the batteries now, uh, it's, uh, yeah, we're, with those additional turbines in there, we have managed to get our batteries fully, fully powered up. So the batteries are keeping up with the uh, power output now and being replenished with the uh, wind turbines so I knew that that was going to be needed and we needed to get this done uh, there'll be more power going in I'm gonna 
uh, put uh, solar panels up as well. I'll need to put those in. And then uh, since we have uranium, uh, I'm thinking about putting two nuclear reactors. Uh, this is going to get built out in through here. And so we'll have a nuclear reactor on this side and a nuclear reactor on this side. And then the uh, solar panels are going to go out this this way and I'll I'll have it set up out in that area out there so that'll be another challenge all to itself uh, getting that set up so that's just a little bit of an update uh, let me get to work on these uh, batteries and the scaffolding and stuff around here and then uh, yeah we'll uh, I'll catch back up with here in just a little bit Alright, well, I am uh, making some progress here on this power station. Uh, although I just discovered something that I probably should change here a little bit. I have this as a corridor, but I think what I should do is take these rails out. And that way it's all one connecting down through here. So let's do that. Let's... Uh, take these out. I did get another battery online so I only have two batteries left to build and that will be uh, a good thing so let's uh, let's see I want this so I need to take let's take this one yeah make sure I didn't grind that down there we go That can stay as it is. And let's get this one and this one. So now what I want to do is put in, we go to our catwalks. Let's grab this one. And let's get the right one here, a single, single one. That's the one we want right there. So if we plop that down, plop that down, there, there, and there, 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 there. I think that's better. Because there was no reason to have railings in between. The idea is that we want the railings to protect from the batteries and that was just going to make a lot of extra walking around to try to if I have to walk over here to get to the batteries and I'm from over here then then I can get down and into here so now I got to build out all these catwalks and whatnot so I'll get started on building those and we'll have this particular power section pretty well done for the moment uh, now I put in uh, a ladder or a stairs over here and I think the next thing I want to do is go ahead and get that door built in to the drone facility so uh, all right so let me get these catwalks all built out and then I'll get started on that uh, door and then we'll kind of see where we're at All right, well, uh, I've got the catwalks all in. Yeah, it looks pretty good, I think. Uh, a little wider right here. I probably could have moved these over and done one less row. Uh, and that probably would have looked better, but it's already in. I'm not going to change that up. And uh, I got all the batteries built. Uh, so <clears throat> these are recharging. You can see that uh, this will be fully charged in four hours and uh, my other ones that were already charged up uh, you can kind of see that uh, they are probably because the power is going over to the others it's going to be fully recharged in one hour 30 minutes so uh, it uh, uh, is <coughs> I'm pretty comfortable with the power situation as it is right now. 
Now, what I want to do is, uh, at some point here, pretty soon, uh, there's a couple of things I got to do. I've, I've got to get the other portion of the Intergalactic Mining and Salvage Company. I got to start uh, salvaging. And so I've got a ship that I need to build that uh, I have that uh, I can go and start uh, grinding down on that old old mill, that old mining settlement down there. And so uh, that's uh, one thing. So I got to get that built. Uh, and so I think power-wise right now uh, I'm in pretty good shape so I can kind of push the solar power and the nuclear power stuff down a little further down the road which also means though I've got to improve on that uranium mine so that uh, when I do build those nuclear power plants uh, <clears throat> let's see so I guess the next thing I want to work on is finishing up some of the stuff inside the uh, drone factory get this door in and get a task list put up like I did in my last uh, season so I think that's going to be the next things that I do so I'm going to go ahead and temporarily put the task list up inside the drone factory for now and then we can uh, kind of watch and then I can move that once once I get the uh, control room built then I can move it over into the control room. Alright, well, once I get a little farther along here, I'll uh, catch back up with you. Alright, well, I have gotten a few more things done here. I, I got this door in. I had to move my remote control over, uh, but here's uh, my door. Uh, we got it in. It's functioning. Uh, I got the stairs all down so that makes a nice access point if I'm out over and in here and I need to go up into the hangar bay I can get up and in here fairly easy just like this uh, I did also get my LCDs up so that's my task list uh, I'll refine it some more but as you can see I got a lot of things to do a beacon light that is a beacon on top of this building here uh, so that uh, as if you're flying in and out, if you're flying in at night, you uh, can see the beacon. Uh, so it's just a safety precaution. Door sensors, I need to set those up uh, so that uh, I don't have to constantly open and close those. Uh, they'll automatically open and close. Uh, light signage on the dock uh, I need to get that put up and put in I want to add some shelves and uh, crates and cartons here in the drone hangar uh, just to add a little more you know aviance to the the building here uh, the uranium mine uh, I need to go out there and get that set up at some point it's a just on the to-do list it's not a high priority uh, set up the nickel drone uh, which I talked about that uh, kind of wanted to take a break from that after uh, dealing with the cobalt one I finally got it up and running properly uh, the nickel one should be a little bit easier but I've got to figure out the proper way to do that one or the proper path really uh, though I guess I put door sensors on there twice so well I'll take that one off uh, actually, let's do that right now. Let's do that. There we go. Okay. Uh, control room. Uh, that's where I'm going to have all of my, you know, uh, programming blocks and stuff like that uh, for part of the base. Uh, I may end up... Uh, you know what? I, I've put the event blocks and the timer blocks <clears throat> underneath each of the drone buildings uh, docking stations and so I think that's a good place for those just to kind of keep them a little <clears throat> more uh, uniform well not uniform but uh, just a little more easier to, to know where everything's at and then I want to work on the assembler building uh, it's out there it's uh, <clears throat> if you look at it, it's just basically partially done there. Uh, it's up there 
you know, uh, just sort of half done. But it's functional. And so at some point, I do got to get back up in there. And uh, I've got an idea on how I'm going to build that out. And so uh, I just got to get up there and do it. Uh, one more thing I want to add to the list. If I can get up there. And that is build the salvage ship. Uh, I've already got the blueprint. I just got to run it. Build salvage ship. There we go. Build salvage ship. Uh, that way we can go down there and start uh, salvaging uh, off that old mining base. There's a lot of materials down there, and that's really the second half of what uh, this uh, intergalactic mining and salvage company is all about. So we're going to go down there and uh, we'll get that ship built and start uh, salvaging uh, parts and stuff from down there. All right, well, that's about it for the moment. Uh, let me do a few more things around here, and then it'll probably be uh, getting fairly close to finishing up the video for the day. And there's that uh, commander out there, that Ember commander. Uh, he's uh, out over there. At some point, we're going to have to deal with him, I guess. Uh, but we're nowhere near getting ready to start uh, tackling him. But we will. At some point, we will take care of him. Uh, all right. Uh, well, uh, I'll get back with you here in just a little bit. All right. Well, I think we're just about going to wrap up today's video. So I got uh, stuff done in here. I did add a little more decoration, uh, some cartons, cargo boxes, freight boxes, uh, some places to sit. Uh, I put a little bit of shelving in. Got some shelving right here. And uh, probably could put something more into here if I wanted to. Put a desk in over here. I did, if you remember, I was having a problem getting into the drone. So I uh, put in a uh, ladder or a stair so that I could get up into the drones once they were built. Uh, let's see. I So I marked off shelves and uh, cartons here in the drone hangar. That's marked off. We also uh, got uh, the power supply done, uh, added another set of wind turbines in there, uh, and we got all the batteries in place now. I got all the catwalks in place, and I added uh, this door here so that we could get into the hangar a lot easier. So I think that's about going to wrap the video up. Uh, next time, I'm not sure when next time what we're going to do next time. I got to think about that. Uh, I, I, th I think I know what I want to do. I want to, I want to build that salvage ship. Uh, and uh, I think I put that on the list in here. Let me double check. Hopefully, I did that. Let's get down here. And yeah, build salvage ship. Uh, I think that's what I want to work on next because I've got to start uh, dismantling some of that and reduce the amount of clutter on this planet. I think that'll... Uh, I've been noticing that the uh, game is starting to pause just a little bit and I don't know if that's from the most recent updates that they just uh, sent out or what, but it uh, has been uh, kind of uh, slowing down a little bit in some spots. All right, well, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video a lot. And please subscribe. That really helps the channel out. All right, all you space engineers out there, keep building away, keep your heads low, and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video.
Thanks for watching, everyone.